There we go. Okay, so our GHC PIN number, uh, personal identification number, is a six-digit number. How many are possible? Okay. Well, we assume we can use the digits 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. All right. So we can use 0. Okay, so that's 10 possible digits in each slot. Okay. Now let's just imagine we have a pin that had just has one number, right, one number. So there are 10 possible um, digits we can plug in, 0 through 9. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, or 9. There's 10 possible. So that would be a one-digit pin. Now that means you could only have 10 students, right? So let's, let's increase that a bit. So if we had a pin number with two numbers possible, right? Now we can have 0 through 9 in this slot and 0 through 9 in this slot, okay? So we're talking about numbers that look like this, 0, 0, or 0, 6, or 4, 7, or 9, 9, or whatever. And you'll find that there's actually 100 of those, right? 10 times 10 is 100. So if there's 10 possible here, that can be combined with 10 possible from here. Um, or in other words, let's say we had 0 in the first slot then we could have 1, or it could be 0, 2, or 0, 3, or all the way to 0, 9. Now that's 10 possible with a 0 in the front, okay? Then we could have 1 in the front, 1, 1, 1, 2, 1, 3, all the way down to 1, 9. That's another 10 possible. Or you could have 2, 1, 2, 2, 2, 3, all the way down to 2, 9. Whoops, 2, 9. That's another 10. And this would go all the way to having 9 in the first slot. So 9, oh, I forgot the 0 at the beginning. Silly me. 0, 0 here, sorry. Uh, 1, 0 here, or 2, 0 here. All right. Or all the way to 9, you could have 9, 0, 9, 1, 9, 2, all the way to 9, 9. So 10 possible here, 10 here, 10 here, all the way up to 9. So this is 10. You basically have 10. Um, groups of 10, which would be 100 possible two-digit numbers, okay? So if you understand that, then the next step is to go, I could take any one of these and add on another digit. Like I could add on, like so for the, for the third digit, you could take any one of these and add on another digit, like, like a zero, um, um, or, or a, or I could go 0, 0, 001 or 0, 0, 002 or 0, 0, 003, you know. So 0, 0, 001 or 0, 0, 002 or 0, 0, 003, all the way up to 9. So for any one of these 100 two digit numbers, I could add on another, uh, I could add 10 digits onto each one. So I could take any one of these, add on another digit, that's 1,000 now, right? Because it's 100 times 10. You get 1,000 possible three digit numbers. Okay, and similarly, you can take one of those three-digit numbers, add any one of ten digits onto the end of it, and then you would have ten thousand possible four-digit numbers. Or you could take any one of those four-digit numbers, add any one of these ten digits to the end to make ten thousand. Sorry, a hundred thousand possible five-digit numbers. Or you could take any of those five-digit numbers and add on another digit. Um, to make a million possible six-digit numbers. So the answer is that there are one million, or ten to the power of six, or one million, one million possible six-digit numbers for a GHC pin. All right.